Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. Today you will see two videos, two small videos, one about ventral hernia, the other is about bilateral renal hydronephrosis with hydroureter due to severe urinary tract infection. Now you can see the gut loops and this is the gap. due to the tear in the peritoneal cavity interiorly in the midline which allows the gut loops to peep through this aperture and come in contact with the musculature of the interior abdominal wall. Now you can see due to the, uh, the, the cuffing of the patient and the patient cuffs the gut loops, the movements of the gut loops is visible through this aperture, through this breach in the musculature of the interior abdominal wall. You can see the movements of the gut loops due to the cuffing. Sonography is a fair, painless, fast, painless, inexpensive and widely available tool usually regarded as first line imaging modality for investigation of interior abdominal wall hernias. Ultrasound can accurately diagnose groin hernias and this may justify its use in its assessment. Now you are going to see the other video and you can see the kidney, the right kidney and the liver and right kidney shows moderate hydronephrosis with minimum hydroureter now you can see minimum hydroureter with moderate hydronephrosis And this is all due to the sludge, thick sludge seen in the urinary bladder. Now you are going to see the left kidney and it also shows the process. This is the urinary bladder and you can see the sludge, a large amount of thick sludge is seen in the urinary bladder due to which this bilateral adrenoprosis with minimum hydroureter is visible. You can find some important information in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe my channel. Thanks.